Well, hey guys, how are you all going? Sorry, there's a little bit of noise in the background. I'm using the GoPro. I can't be bothered getting the wireless mics all set up and stuff like that. I'm just heading on my way to go for a walk with my mate Mike. Hopefully, we can get a walk in before it rains. But anyway, um, I'm going to talk to you about this YouTube Australia, New Zealand. Facebook group I created many years ago and over the years it's really grown to the point that I'm quite happy where it is right now though during that time I've had to deal with a lot of problems what main one being people trying to join that aren't in Australia or New Zealand that's one of the main things I have I state in there that you must agree to the terms and conditions of the group you must state where you are in Australia or New Zealand that made things a bit hard for me because I don't really know New Zealand and areas in New Zealand very well. But I get a lot of people from um, Indonesia and other countries trying to join all the time. They lie saying where they're from, but you can kind of tell and do a bit of a background check and yep, they're from India or Indonesia or something. Yeah. So, yeah, that's one of the hard things. And luckily, lately, I've bought, got on board some really cool new moderators to come and help. Hey Tammy and everyone else really do help a lot by offering their time to go through some of this stuff. Um, occasionally you'll get a, an upset. Remember I had one just last week and it did kind of get under the skin a bit because the point of the group is not about getting views or getting you subs and stuff like that it's about helping each other as a community so I have certain rules on there and this person messaged me saying how I should be encouraging everybody to have to go around subscribe to each other and have to view each other's videos and stuff like that thing is I won't ever push that kind of thing because that's not real views, that's not real subs. Um, someone will post their channel on there, I'll go and check it out. And if I like what I see, I'll subscribe to it. But I'm not going to just subscribe to someone to support them. I subscribe to them because, hey, I like their content, I want to watch it. And that's good for them too, because that means that I'm more invested into watching their stuff, leaving comments and giving them that support. If someone who just goes and subscribes to the channel just to try and help them. It's not going to give them views. It's not going to really help that channel at all. So yeah, this person went on about that and said, well, whether I, like, whether I do it or not, she's going to comment on all the comments on the Facebook group, basically flooding everything. And that, I have a, I try, I've already warned her in the past. She kept just kept on commenting, on it, going down the whole list on the Facebook, leaving comments. Some of them was just comments for the sake of leaving a comment. And the way the Facebook group works, that means that people that post their latest video get pushed down the line because someone's basically flooding the system with all these really unnecessary comments. So I, I asked her nicely to stop doing that. And then she sent me that nasty that email, so I said no. She got a bit grumpy, so I just removed her from the group had enough and that's not what the group's about and she just wasn't listening and basically threatening to basically flood the Facebook group with all the comments so I removed her from the group and then she sent me a pretty nasty message during the week saying how much basically had a go at me almost personally and even having a go at my YouTube channel saying how her channel is so much bigger and more successful than mine well, if you're counting this vlogging channel, yeah, it's got a very small amount of sub base. It, this channel's more of a place for me to just voice my opinions and some fun videos. My main YouTube channel, though, and I could have replied back to her with this, has got over 1,400 um, subscribers. Yeah, it's still not huge, especially <laughs> compared to... I looked on the line the other day and PewDiePie has over 11 million, 11, no, not 111 million subscribers, 111 million. Oh. Anyway, <laughs> but yeah, I 
have over a million views on that channel and I could have replied back to her and put her back in her place because she had something like 400 and something subscribers. But this is pretty good. The sad thing is, a lot of her videos are really quite good and I didn't mind them. And I actually was subscribed to her channel, but after the way that she had a go at me, basically a personal go at me, I um, unsubscribed and she then left me another message on another of my Facebook accounts and so she's now banned and blocked on all my accounts because yeah it's not what that YouTube slash Facebook group is about it's all about helping each other grow as video creators but it's not about providing false and fake subscribe accounts and fake views and stuff like that no the only way your Facebook sorry YouTube account will grow is if people subscribe to you and leave comments and watch your videos because they want to you can't force someone to subscribe to you you can't buy it. people used to be guilty of this in the past where people would pay money to get subscribers like actually I've got a good friend who He's a great guy, he's got over 30,000 subscribers. And um, some of his videos get hardly any views. So you might have 30,000 subscribers, but sometimes you have videos only get a couple hundred views. So you can buy all the subscribers you want. But if you're not getting those views and stuff like that, you're not gonna get anywhere. So that's not what the group is about. The group is all about helping each other grow by giving each other advice, help, we can, we can show off our latest videos, one per day. Simple things like that. Um, I allowed, I made it a rule stating that you had to um, wait 20 minutes after the previous video, because I just found that when someone posted a video, someone else would go, oh, that's a great idea, I'll post my video. And you get a f two or three or four posts in a row, pushing the poor guy who just posted his video right down. So I had that rule in that, you know, after 20 minutes, that upset a couple of people too, but, you know, I put my time and some money actually into helping promote these channels and these Facebook groups and stuff like that. And just sometimes people, you can't please everyone. Anyway, I'm just about at mics now, so I'll catch you guys in a future video. Catch you all later.